Hey guys, I am so, so excited for this. You have no idea. I'm reacting to, as you can tell by the title, Taylor Swift Speak Now, Taylor's version. <laughs> If you guys don't know, or if you do know, if you know me, you know Speak Now is a hero tales of album of all times. The very first one I ever heard in my entire life. My cousin got me the album. My first ever like music album, first ever artist I ever was really into was Taylor Swift. I was like eight or nine years old. I listened to it every single night before I went to bed. Every single night for like almost two years. I know that album beginning to end so, so well. Every lyric, every word, everything. And it was just everything to me. I carried around the album in my backpack for two years, grade three and grade four, I think. It was very crazy and silly of me. I used to study the lyrics till I knew every word. And that's why it's like my brain is split up into pieces and part of it is speak now I have no idea what to expect I really didn't look into all the little like vault songs and everything before because I didn't want to like spoil anything I wanted like a full like I wanted to like have my reaction from everything All right, I just went to go download the album Obviously, I know the first song so it's gonna be kind of like a little fun moment Honestly for red like I could tell the songs were different But she honestly sounds so similar to the original versions of all her music It's like hard to tell but like you can tell but it's like she sounds so similar Where's my speaker? All right, and the first song, mine. Oh, you can tell the difference for sure. Dude, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> you were in college. It's way more chill, this version. I was a flight risk with the fear of falling. Wondering why we bother with love if it never lasts. I say, can you believe it? remember hearing that song for the very first time like this is very like like I could cry <laughs> like I could cry you don't understand I could cry people don't get it it's the same music obviously but it just like it's so much more than that because like everything she had to go through in order to get here now her Taylor's versions are doing better than her originals but like, that's huge no other artist can do that let's be serious for a second let's be serious let's be serious disclaimer right now i know i'm gonna miss a lot of things that she adds in the songs but this video can't be three hours long you know what i mean if it could i would love it to be but i'm gonna have to skip some parts and there's gonna be cuts in this video so you're not gonna hear every like special thing she put in the song just to let you guys know all my other reaction videos someone's always like you missed this part you missed that well trust me i listen to it but it's just not in the video you don't get it i'm obsessed now we're gonna go to sparks fly <laughs> guys i feel like a child where you move is like a fall on I feel like this is not gonna be talking. I'm not like reacting to anything. I'm just singing. So honestly, sing along with me, guys. Back in December, one of my all-time favorites off the album. You've been good. Busier than ever I haven't been sleeping Staying up Playing back Myself even And I think about summer All the beautiful times I watched you loving From the passenger side I'm debating wearing a purple dress For Speak Now Because I'm seeing her in <laughs> And her snotty little family All dressed in pastel Like a pastry I feel like this version is very like like slowed not slowed but like it's very more like acoustic side i feel like there's more like instrumentals in the original version which is totally fine oh my gosh dear john i cried to this like every day this was so crazy i guess it's like possible to recreate albums but i feel like she recreated them so similar were the nights when my days once revolved around you slower i'm pretty sure counting my footsteps Sorry, so so good. Not my knees. <laughs> I'm gonna go through these kind of fast because, like, I feel like we already heard them, but I'm gonna stop at ones that I really, really love the most. I could tell the difference with this one. Knock me off my feet again. Got me feeling like a nothing. Living in a big old city, and all you're ever gonna be is me. Why you gotta be so mean? Dude, she really did that. I used to think one day we tell the story of us, how we met and the sparks flew instantly. Things that I wish you knew, so many walls up, I can't break through. Okay, now we have Never Grow Up. This song's gonna hit a lot differently because I'm moving out of my house for the very first time. Losing your mind of your childhood. Ooh, I got shivers. That's what it sounded like. 
Dude. Here I am in my new apartment in a big city. They just dropped me off. Dude, I need to never listen to that again. And I've enchanted. Okay, now for Better Than Revenge. I've heard a lot of things about this one. I feel like people are like speculating the lyric change or something. Now go stand in the corner and think about what you did. She took him faster than you could say sabotage. She was a he was a moth to the flame. She was holding the matches. Taylor Allison Swift. Other people's toys on the playground will make him many friends. I was saying that song like I really meant it. Like I felt like I had something to like be revengeful for. And like, girl, I was like literally nine. <laughs> Cause you really did it this time. And everybody believed in you. I love Haunted. Hard on this one. Fun fact, I used to play the violin when I was younger and I would try to play the song on the violin and I can tell you it didn't sound the same. When I walk a fragile line, I have known it all this time, but I never thought it It sounds so different. version is so good. I really, 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 really want this to be one of our special songs, but I think she already sang it perfectly, so she's not gonna sing it again. I'm really sad about that, because I love this song so much. I said, remember this moment In the back of my mind Shaking hands, the crowd's in stance went wild I, the song is so cute. Don't you worry, your pretty little mind. People throw rocks at things that shine in life. Makes a love look hard. Now for the vault songs. Here we go, here we go. We've got One Will Fall Boy and Haley Williams. Okay, so Conspiracy Theory is because Paramore's show is the day after Taylor's concert in Seattle. So we think that Haley and Taylor are gonna perform the song together, and I really hope so. This is Electric Touch with Fall Out Boy. Okay, just an hour till your car's in the driveway. Okay. Just the first time ever hanging out. Is this good either? Pete Wentz is a guy from Fall Out Boy, right? Anyways, this one is when Emma falls in love. Emma falls in love, she paces the floor, closes the blinds, I love and it. locks the door. I love it. When Emma falls in love, she calls up her mom. That you can't put down. Like you feel that you grew up in a small. So I love how these songs are like so country. Like I'm not a country fan, like almost at all. But something about Taylor's voice in country, just like, I like country now, you know? Cute! <laughs> Next one is I Can See You. I want Emma, when Emma falls in love, to be a special song for us. I'd be very excited. Uh, uh, uh. Okay! You brush past me in the hallway and you don't think I, I, I can see it, do you? I something's changed. It's it looks good. I that's the best one so far. Are we kidding? Next one is Castles Crumbling featuring Haley Williams. Would hang on my words and they trusted me. Oh, I love this. I love this. Too far. I held that grudge. The next one's called The Foolish One. My cards are on the table. Yours are in your hand. And chances are I will talk. To sleep again. I don't know if I got this wrong. I'm not sure if I do, but are the vault songs like songs she wrote when the album, like when she's writing the album, or songs she's been writing and just added them to the album? Like that part I forget. Down the block, there's an antique shop. Two lovers slept on the porch of the first house. Pray to God you'd be coming home. Alright. This is so cute. Alright, that is it for the album. Taylor Swift Speak Now, Taylor's version, plus from the vault songs. I, I don't know, I just love Speak Now. I feel like I was in a trance that whole entire time and took me back to when I was nine years old and it came out. Depending on the time it came out, I was either eight or nine, but I was turning nine no matter what. 13 years? 13. 
13 years it's just so crazy i just feel like like she's definitely come so far i've only seen her once on the red tour and i'm seeing her again hopefully two nights so far i only have one ticket for night two but i hopefully i'll get one for night one if not i'll just be partying in the streets with everybody else that's gonna be so fun to like partying in the streets with everyone so so fun i don't even know like obviously if you're a swifty you know like everything she went through to like re-release these again and the fact that they're way bigger is just slap in the face i was talking about this with my friends the other day how like scooter braun is so different and different like fandoms i guess like in justin bieber like you love scooter ron you know what i mean and for taylor swift you hate scooter ron and i'm big fans of both so it's like dude i don't even know how i feel about him it's just i love her so much and i'm so happy for her and this album is amazing beginning to end i love the from the vault songs i'm gonna have to re-listen to them over and over again just in case she sings them and it's one of the surprise songs because i'm going to know every single lyric for the surprise songs i'm not even joking let me know how you felt about like how she sounded definitely sounded way more mature way more different i feel like a lot of them were slowed down there's less like instrumentals and stuff with them but then some of them there's more instrumentals i don't really know but overall she did a really good job in like trying to replicate it and then changing the words in better than revenge girl one thing about taylor is she is smart yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you guys in my next video bye